All right, Coach, following the uh, red-white scrimmage, just your thoughts overall on the scrimmage. I think overall we look okay. I think we look better than we have in practice. Um, I think the, the starting lineup that we're looking at seemed a little better today than it has in the past couple days of practice. So um, pretty aggressive serving. I think we still need to continue to work on servicing. Going along with the serving, Red had 13 aces, White had two. Okay. Obviously, Red taking all five games. Sure. Is that kind of the big thing, the difference between the Red and the White, or were there some other things as well? Well, we mixed up the lineups, I think, all five games. We had a couple starting lineups out there, maybe game one and two. Um, other than that, we kind of mixed it up a little bit. So, yeah, I think our big focus is serving. I think we have some aggressive servers. We're trying to get a couple of our jump servers to serve a little more aggressively, and I think we had most of those servers on the Red team consistently. So, um, we also had a little more ball control on the Red team. So I think that's a combination of both. A lot of individuals stood out, but two in particular, Tasha with 17 kills and then Missy with 14. Just talk about how those two have kind of grown maybe throughout preseason and what they did well today. I think we knew with Missy coming in as freshman that we were going to rely on her on the outside. She hits a heavy ball. We just got to see if she can do that day in and day out, especially playing you know two matches in a day or two or three in a weekend, I think, to see if her stamina is going to last. Uh, if her legs are going to let her to continue to jump like she does. I think Tasha, we expected her to come in and kind of be a little more offensive threat for us this year. I think she's done a really good job working in the spring, getting better, becoming a little more offensive minded. Um, and we're doing a better job of feeding her the ball, especially in out of system plays. Um, we're having our libero come in and set her that second ball. And I think she's doing a good job of just mixing up the shots. Classes start on Monday, so this kind of ends the preseason camp. Just talk about the progress that you guys have made. You know, not only with a lot of newcomers, but being a newcomer yourself. I think the transition, at least for myself and Ben, has been pretty easy. I think the past six months um, has just been a learning process for both of us. I feel pretty comfortable and confident going into next weekend as far as uh, who we have on the roster. So I think coming in, we knew it was going to be a long preseason just with, the, obviously, the seven freshmen and the transfer and um, the returners playing in different positions that we've, they've been asked to do that in the past. So I think throughout the two weeks, we've progressively gotten better. I think our goal is to get better throughout the season. Um, obviously, play better and better each each match and be playing our best ball at the end of the year. And then just, you know, with one week left, what are, your, what are some things you want to cross off on your list? You know, goals, I guess, for the final week. I think we're going to break down a little bit of blocking next week. We've got to talk about, um, you know, crossing patterns and things like that. We haven't really touched that. I think just continuing to improve on our communication skills, getting a little more comfortable in our positions um, for this weekend and getting the starters feeling like that we can go out and play from point one and not waiting till the second match to, to feel comfortable with what we're doing. And then since we're going to announce the team captains today, just talk about uh, Haley and Danny, what their roles will be in that role as being a captain. Obviously, I think Haley has the most playing experience coming in as with the six returners, so we decided that, you know, just with that, we need to make her a team captain. I think she's just a good role model overall and just really good of leading by example type of captain. I think Danny, obviously being a setter, we've asked a lot of her this spring and coming into the fall. I think she's becoming more and more vocal, and that's something that I'm going to stress on her, and I think it's going to help her um, stay a little more calm with her emotions, a little more even keel and something that we're going to need out of her consistent, consistently throughout the season, especially being so young. I think it's only going to help her mental-wise become a stronger player. All right. Thanks, Coach. Enjoy the